When I first started working as a veterinary technician, I was under the impression that everyone around me had the ideal pet. No one's dog ever got sick, never got injured, never acted up. Since then, due to my own stories, I've learned it's drastically different. My dog Magnum came down with this disease with absolutely no signs at the time. We woke up on a nice Sunday morning, I was getting ready to go to work, when I found my dog laying on the floor. He couldn't get up, he couldn't move, and he was crying every time we tried to touch him. I brought him in with me to work on emergency, it cost a lot of money, and within an hour of him being there, they took 21 x-rays of his spine and started talking about wheelchairs. There's no way I could afford the surgery. This disease is unfortunately something that can strike at any time. There's no way to test ahead of time, no way to try and prevent it. The only thing you can do is treat it. It can cost tons of money, obviously, and it, it can be deadly if not taken care of. I think it's time that owners need to fight back. I've seen Far too many dogs have to be put to sleep because they can't afford the surgeries or the treatment for this situation. It's not fair to the dogs and it's definitely not fair to the owners who are blind, losing a pet and blaming themselves for not being able to prevent this. I think that we need to start a fund. And many animal hospitals will actually help you start funds to donate for treating certain syndromes, situations, diseases, and so on. Um, it's definitely a good thing to do, and you never know when you could wind up needing it. Might as well donate to try and fight back. So that's about it. <laughs>